Welcome back to Primetime News. And a special welcome once again to our viewers on OneSpotMedia.com. Up first this evening, more devastating news for the education sector. After a bus transporting students plunged over a precipice in St. James this afternoon. The bus driver is dead and at least six people, including four students, are injured. Details in this report from Dwayne Anderson. Tragedy in St. James. The bus plunged more than 100 feet below. Aboard was the driver and several passengers. Superintendent Aaron Samuels is the acting commanding officer for the St. James Police. He explained the circumstances surrounding the crash. A motor bus that plies the Cambridge to Montego Bay route um, seemed to have been, not been able to negotiate a corner coming down the Longview, which ended in that bus going over the precipice. The driver died. His identity is not yet known. The ambulance has assisted six members of the public uh, who were in the bus to the um, to the hospital which includes four students and two adults um, there are other persons who were on the bus who managed to um, assist or with assistance make their way out of the, the the bush it is still not clear how many people were aboard the bus the fire brigade they did a marvelous job in assisting with the rescue efforts um, they were quick on the scene and quick to um, bring the persons who were injured out of the the, the terrain too the ambulances i myself went down there to see if there were anybody if anybody else was left behind and it was a treacherous walk it took us about 10 to 15 minutes from the main road here to the crash point um we saw what remains of a i think a bus um, based on how badly it was damaged it is also not clear what caused the crash the incident also led to a major buildup of traffic in the Long Hill area of St. James and stretched back into parts of Hanover and Montego Bay. Heavy rainfall also impeded the recovery efforts. Persons are being encouraged to proceed with caution in the area, which is a known crash hotspot, especially when it rains. My take back from this to the public is just utilize our road with care. Um, we know that based on the condition of the road, you may not be speeding. But we want persons to go down to a snail's pace whenever there is any moisture, rain, heavy rain, uh, drizzle on this road. Dwayne Anderson, TVJ News.